Hello, good evening. Jaguar Land Rover will soon start building cars in China to meet demand in its fastest growing market. The company sold more than 50,000 cars there this year, but heavy importation taxes make them expensive. Well, soon, 100,000 cars will roll off the production line in China. But Jaguar Land Rover has always stressed this is to meet extra demand. And production will not be shifted from its factories in the Midlands. ITV News has been to China to gauge the success of the British brand. Our business correspondent Mark Goff has the details. It's fast becoming a big name in China. Jaguar Land Rover has 141 dealerships here and they sold 53,000 cars in the first nine months of this year. That's 200 cars a day, more than double the amount they sold in the whole of 2011. Gao Lei is looking at a Range Rover Evoque, Jaguar Land Rover's biggest seller in China. She's one of the new middle class with money to spend and they want to spend it on a British car. It's very fashionable. When you drive it on the road, it attracts everyone's attention. Everyone is going to look at it and say, wow, this car is so beautiful. Importation tax means Gao Lei's Evoque costs more than it would in the UK. Building them in China means Jaguar Land Rover can make them cheaper. It's formed a joint venture with Chinese car maker Cherry Automobile. Cherry Automobile. Soon, 100,000 Jaguar Land Rovers will be rolling off the production lines. 77,000 Freelanders and Evokes, and 30,000 Jaguars currently made at Castle Bromwich in Birmingham. We don't see it as a threat to UK production. In fact, um, we see it as good news because it will help the company expand and help them more, become more profitable. There's no suggestion production will switch from Birmingham to China. In fact, two new models are being built at Castle Bromwich. And also the China deal is creating jobs in the supply chain here. Sirtec in Coles Hill makes parts for the Evoque. They're members of the ITV Business Club. They'll now ship Evoque parts to China. It's a deal worth £10 million a year to this factory. And We're absolutely delighted. We already supply 180 Evoque parts into the UK factories. We'll now be supplying additional parts into the Chinese factories. It's a massive order to Sirtec. It means an additional 100 jobs. In Beijing, being a Jaguar Land Rover car dealer is good business. Uh, Jason Lin says the cars are expensive, but they're good quality. And if someone owns one, it's a symbol that they're doing well. In China, they're doing well. And success there should mean workers here will do well too. Mark Goff in Birmingham for Central tonight. And you can see uh, more on that story on our website. Just head to uh, itv.com central.